Hey guys, how's it going? And um, welcome to my second hour tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how to use a plugin called Point Runner. So without any further ado, let's get started. So to get started, you want to stand in your game lobby. But the way, the way everything works is the game. You have your game, then you have the arenas, separate arenas, and the separate arenas will have like different map layouts, like. Let me go to one right now. Here is the one I use for example. So they'll have this one, and then you'll have a different arena, which will be a different layout. And then we join the game, it will randomise what arena. It'll be random the arena you can join. So it's not always it's not the same every time. So you join the game, you won't join the arenas. So you have your game, then your arenas. So what you want to do is pick your game lobby and every lobby for every game is separate. So you want to do a PR, G, then plus, then uh, the game name, which I'm just going to put for tut. Then I want to do PR, A for arena, plus, and the, the game name, then arena name. And I'll create a one arena. Then I want to go to the arena, which I'm going to use for example here. Go up to the top corner. This is this will stop people who's inside the arena from getting out when they're in spectator mode. So you do PR, pause one, then the arena name, the game name, sorry, then the arena. Then now set position one. Then you go to opposite corner. And you'll put it down here. Then you put two. Then you want to do the ground level, then the spectator level, which I'm going to put here. So PR, GL, tut, then one, then change that to an S. And also you can set the minimum players and the block delay. So you'll do PR set, then your name which is tut. Then you'll have a list of things you can set. So you can set the game time, rounds, and rounds is like you at different arenas, so you can put three, so every round it will slide different arena. So do PR, delay, block, or PR, set, tut, delay, block, Walk. This is what I recommend putting it to 5 so it's best. Then you want to set, I'm going to set main players to 1 so I can join. And then we'll go to spot, we'll go to spawn and we'll set up the signs so you can join. You can also do PR join. Oh, so you can, I'm not going to do that. Let's get the signs. And all these messages and things are all editable in the config, so you can edit the signs. Like as you always see when I've done this, I've already edited the sign. Then I read the name, which, the game name, which is Tut. Then it won't update. You have to right-click it, then join. Then you can just do that. Then I'll leave. See, it will say starting, but it's only it's only saying starting because when I joined, it was already starting. So I'll right-click again. As you can see, it's already starting. But if I if, I, if there's two people and I joined and it and it's only one one more player, it would still be same waiting. So it's starting up. Then it's even the titles. You can customize all this in the title and the config. Sorry. So it'll take you to arena. Then it'll start the first round. Then you have your points. All the scoreboard is customizable as well. So we can play. And then you. Have Points is down in your XP bar as well. And all the points is all customizable as well in the config. It's a really customizable plugin. And look, as, I, as I said, you can you can't get out of the arena because you set the positions. And then round two will start. So yeah guys, this is point on it. Um, if there's any questions, leave it in the description or go to the spigot page and ask the developer. So I hope you all, I hope you all enjoyed and I hope you all have an amazing day. Thank you for watching. Bye.